All right, so if I go to a front view, you can see how this is a little too big. So I'm just going to shift drag this out to the side. Um, <clears throat> I can see how um, his body should be about half the size it is. So I think what I'm going to do is just scale it and make it about half the size it is. Uh, minus these minus these polygons here. So let's scale it down about like that and let's bring it up to about here and bring it back towards the center. Now I just kind of eyeballed that but you can well I'm we're gonna fix it right now. So um you can kill this side because apparently it's not the copy anymore. So bring this down. Um, you can see his body's about, <laughs> and I just scaled him um, vertically. I don't think I scaled him um, in the other direction. So let's get all of these polygons. Um, let's just grab everything we just had. So let's get his shoulder. And let's get rid of the feet. And what I want to do is just scale him front to back because it doesn't need to be that thick. Um, and then we'll deal with his feet here in a second. So um, his arm is too by vertice. So I want to grab all of this and I'm just going to bring it in. I like that. So I can take these birds here and just bring them closer to the center of his body. Make sure that they're still working. Um, let's take all of this and I'm just going to scale it just a tad bit and move it over where it needs to be. So let's hit G. Go to the grid. So this is headed in the right direction. Um, you can see the head is just too small. So let's grab this and get rid of that. And we're just going to scale this head up quite a bit. Something like that. And it looks like I wound up with um, looks like I wound up with a problem on, on the bottom part of his jaw thing. So um, I would just fix all that. So if I come in here, this is gonna go up and forward. Um, and I'm just gonna fix all these verts here. So Grab those three, move those forward, grab these, move these forward, and something like that. Let's move this up. All right, so what I want to do is, if I hit F to go to front view, hit G to turn on the grid, I can see that his head is just way off grid now. So I know that this, um, uh, so let's just try to get this to the center line. So if I hit this, I'm going to right click, I'm going to say this, you can hit, uh, ask for snap, so I click this three, um, vertex and point, you want to take off grid point, well, grid point, well, no, I guess you do want grid points on. Okay. Um, so what I want to do is snap this to a grid. So if I start to move it, it's going to snap to the grid. Now you can see that some of these points are not on the on the grid. So we have to fix that. But um, let's get a little bit closer. What I want to do is is do the border. So I'll hit S to turn snap off. 
grab this border. I'm going to control click on the vertices. I want to make them planar on the X. And then I want to make that. Right click on that to go to zero. So if I go to a front view now, if I hit F, I should see everything on the center line. So this foot, I would want much bigger in the front. So I'm going to grab all these verts and just make them like way bigger. And let's take these verts here in the back. And I just want them much skinnier ankle. And let's take this one, move forward. And this one, move forward. And these are going to go down like so. So, same with these verts on this side. Then drag them straight down. And then probably take that and move it out a little bit. Shoot. <coughs> <coughs> So, something like that. And you can add more shape to it if you wanted to. Um, you can grab this and lean it down a little bit. And you can bring this up a little, just a little bit. Just so it kind of has a slant towards this side, not that side. So something like that. So that's that's a little bit better. You, you can see that the, the character here, um, his shoulders are doing you know it's kind of, kind of this devious thing with the the this negative curve here, and um, so you may want to try to bring that in a little bit, and even. Maybe do another curve here, like another edge loop, and you can even grab these verts here and just simply rotate just just a little bit, just so it kind of matches up. Um, the chest, you can see it kind of pops out here. Grab the wrong vert, so if I take these two and bring them up, bring them out a little bit. And there's not really like a, a like a peck. It's not really like a like a certain point is poking out above everything else. It's kind of um, it's kind of just a general shape. So um, these hips are really a little bit wide, so you would need to bring them in so they were like really sort of narrow. Um, let's take this down a little bit. So again, you want to think of these loops as roads. So you want the road to be smooth as it as it goes around. Um, all right, so that's that's a good rough end, and then you would, you know, you would you would build on top anything you wanted to do on top of there, um, and of course the hand. So and I'll put up a separate hand video. If you hit, um, well, in here you have to do a turbo smooth. So all right, um, trying to get my modifier list to come up. So turbo smooth, what I was going to say when I said or is um, NERMS. So if I did something like that, you can obviously see he gets much smoother. If I take F5 off, 
you can kind of see where he's, he's going there. So, I don't really have the smile um, blocked in yet, but the rest of them is kind of there. So, alright.